Have you ever seen a multi-story complex designed not by humans, but by birds? Or witnessed a nest that expands as the chicks grow? What about a bird's home that weighs nearly three tons? Forget about human architects. These birds have been perfecting the art of construction for centuries. They elevate architecture to a whole new level. Today, we'll showcase the 10 hardest working and most skilled architectural birds in nature. Get ready to be amazed. Hit the like button and subscribe, and let's jump right in. The woodpecker could give any carpenter a run for their money. These birds aren't just randomly attacking your favorite trees. They're busy crafting the ultimate nursery for their young. Woodpeckers have a simple yet ambitious plan. Find a tree, make a hole, and call it home. They use their beaks like chisels, hammering away with such rhythm and dedication that you'd think they're trying to meet a construction deadline. But their craftsmanship doesn't stop at making a cozy cavity for nesting. These clever birds also carve out small holes to store their food. The interior of a woodpecker's tree is minimalistic in design. It's functional, with storage filled with nuts and insects, ensuring that even during the lean months, the pantry is just a peck away. Ever seen a bird build a multi-story complex? The sociable weaver's colonial nest is considered the most complex nest in the bird world. These community-oriented birds take living together to a whole new level. They build enormous communal nests on telephone poles and trees. Think of it as the high-rise of the savanna. The design is so intricate and roomy that it can house over a hundred birds. Imagine that hundreds of birds are under one roof and not a single noise complaint filed. Their nests are not just big. They're built to last for decades, outlasting many human-made homes. Inside these mega-nests, there are separate chambers for each family, because even in the bird world, everyone appreciates a little privacy. It's the ultimate in avian real estate, proving that when it comes to housing, birds might just be smarter than us. Of all birds in the world, bald eagles hold the record for the biggest nest ever built. One nest in Florida was 6.1 meters deep, 2.9 meters wide, and weighed 2,722 kilograms almost three tons. Could a bald eagle nest this size fit in your classroom? Actually, eagles keep adding sticks to the nest and continuing to build onto them for many years. In most regions, a pair of eagles starts working on their nest from one to three months before the female lays the first egg. They probably prefer a territory close to water where they can catch fish for their babies without wasting time flying back and forth a long distance. Also, they have to choose a healthy tree to last for the future. One well-studied Ohio nest was used for 34 years, until the tree finally blew down. If you thought the previous birds were impressive, wait till you hear about the Montezuma or a Pendula. These birds are the thrill-seekers of the avian world, building nests that look like something out of an adventure park. Each nest is crafted like a hanging basket, skillfully woven from fibers and vines, and dangles from the tip of a tree branch. Imagine a hammock but for eggs. The real genius of these nests is their placement. By hanging them from the slenderest branches, these birds ensure that no large predators can make it to the nest without shaking things up literally. It's like setting up a security system that says, sure, you can try and get up there, but let's see if you can do it without swinging wildly and alerting everyone. This architectural marvel not only keeps the egg safe, but also adds a little thrill to the lives of the baby or appendulous, swinging gently in the breeze. If you like this video so far, leave a like to let me know you like it. Onto the Vogelkop Bowerbird, an artist and an architect rolled into one. This bird doesn't just build nests, it creates masterpieces designed to impress. The Vogelkop Bowerbird constructs what is known as a bower. Not so much a home, but more of a stage for performance art, where the main act is trying to impress a mate. The main bird starts by building a structure from twigs, which serves as the framework. But here's where it gets artsy. He decorates this framework with all manner of objects he can find, from colorful leaves and flowers to shiny bits of glass and metal. Each item is placed with precision, creating a visually striking display that screams, look how resourceful and creative I am. The male usually creates paths leading to the bower, lined with decorations essentially guiding the female through an art gallery of his own making. The Baya Weaver birds are the perfectionists of the avian architecture world. 
These feathered engineers don't just throw together some twigs and call it a day. No, the bioweaver crafts its home with the kind of precision that would make a Swiss watchmaker nod in approval. Each nest is a beautifully woven basket made from long strips of grass artfully tied together. The construction process is a real sight, involving a complex series of knots and loops, which the bird intricately weaves using its beak and feet. Designed with a long tube leading to a spherical chamber, the structure ensures that predators have a tough time reaching the cozy interior where the eggs rest. It's like a medieval castle with a drawbridge, but in bird form and hanging from a tree branch. Then we have the Southern Masked Weaver, another genius in the weaving world. This bird's approach to nest building is all about customization and climate control. Like its cousin, the Bioweaver, this bird constructs a woven nest. However, it places a strong emphasis on the nest orientation and ventilation to keep it cool under the hot African sun. The Southern Masked Weaver selects materials accurately, choosing only the finest grasses that can withstand the elements. The nest features a cozy chamber and a protective canopy, ingeniously designed to shield the young ones from predators and the elements. Each nest is an individual masterpiece, tailored to the specific needs of its feathered creator. And when the breeding season is over, these birds don't get sentimental. They often tear down the nest and start fresh next year. Because who doesn't appreciate a good renovation? Imagine being so detail-oriented that even your home has to be hot couture. Welcome to the world of the Taylor Bird, a small bird with a flair for fashion and architecture rolled into one. These birds use their sharp beaks like sewing needles, not for embroidery, but for constructing their homes by literally sewing leaves together. They thread spider silk or plant fibers through leaves to stitch them into a cozy, camouflaged pocket that hides their nests from nosy predators. The Taylor Bird's nest is like a leafy green tent expertly stitched to ensure it blends seamlessly into the surrounding vegetation. It's not just about looking good. These nests are a masterclass in functional design, providing shelter, insulation, and stealth. If the tailor bird is the boutique designer, then the stork is the ambitious high-rise designer of the bird world. These birds are known for building enormous nests atop trees, poles, rooftops, and other high structures. Their approach is less about privacy and more about domination, seeing, and being seen. Each year, they return to the same nest, adding more sticks and debris, causing these structures to become massive over time, some even weighing hundreds of kilos. Stork nests aren't just big, they're communal hubs. Often these nests become the high-rise apartments of the avian world, hosting not just the stork family, but freeloaders like sparrows and starlings too. Built to last, these nests are reused and renovated each year, growing only larger and more impressive with age. It's like gathering family heirlooms, except instead of jewelry, it's twigs and mud, sustainable architecture at its finest. Which of these nests did you find the most surprising? Let us know in the comments below. We'd love to hear what fascinated you the most. And remember to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to join us for more explorations of the world's unique cultures. Thank you for watching.